Good morning, I'm Janelle Burrell with your morning digital news brief for this Wednesday, October 12th. Breaking this morning, three Philadelphia police officers are in the hospital after a shooting in West Poplar. We're told that the officers, who are members of the department SWAT team, were shot during a standoff. All of them are in stable condition. A civilian was also injured by that gunfire. Two people were taken into custody. And a woman has hit, a car has hit a woman in Kensington. Now the driver of that car is facing charges. Philadelphia police say the driver struck several parked cars around midnight along the 3300 block of Kensington Avenue. The woman was hurt while getting items out of her vehicle. She was left with a serious leg injury. And the owner of the trolley car donor says it's finally on the move. The landmark getting rolling this morning after several failed attempts. The trolley is leaving Mount Airy for a storage facility in Wayne Junction where it will be restored for future use. Now for a check of our next weather forecast, here's meteorologist Andrew Kozak. Good morning, Andrew. Good morning. We are going to continue to see increasing cloud cover, thickening clouds into your Thursday. Wednesday is the transition day. Thursday is your next next weather alert day. Let's start off with their tracking rain and storms future cast because as the clouds continue to roll in, the rain will start to approach. We are dry today, but we're going to start to see the first few drops on the windshield early in the morning on Thursday. By lunchtime, it is soggy, and by the afternoon, not only rain, but rumbles of thunder and some of those could be strong to severe Thursday evening before the front clears us out and dries us out. By Friday morning, we're looking at really nice conditions, but a marginal risk out there. That is the lowest step on the ladder. It means we could be looking at some gusty winds and some heavy rain. Today, 72 degrees. Tonight, down to 61 with thickening clouds. That late shower action happens after 3 a.m. Then we're back into 70 degrees for Thursday with some strong to severe thunderstorms. After that, Friday looks great. The weekend looks even better. Next week, cooler Monday and Tuesday. All right. Thank you, Andrew. And remember, you can always get Andrew's most up-to-date forecast and latest stories right here on CBSPhiladelphia.com. That's the latest for your morning digital brief. I'm Janelle Burrell. Have a great day.